Okay, ladies and gentlemen, it's been a really long day, but I can't finish my day without talking about this. I've tried to let hours pass without talking about it, but I just can't, haven't said a word about it to nobody until now. No, I think I did mention it to one person. This report right here, IDF, Israeli Defense Forces, confirm Islamic Jihad rocket misfire struck Gaza's hospital. Now, pay attention, ladies and gentlemen. Google says that if I report this, that I am giving misinformation. Well, I want you to see this is from the Jerusalem Post. Jerusalem Post. But they say that only certain people get to report on the war, and you can't speak against it. Now, don't you dare. So let me help you out so that y'all will know that I don't give a, um, uh, excuse me, <sighs> rocket fire by factions on the Gaza Strip often falls short with Palestinians killed and a number of past so-called strikes. Ladies and gentlemen, let me explain something to y'all. Y'all see them rockets that, that, that they claim Hamas and Lebanon be firing into Israel? Hezbollah? Y'all, y'all see them rockets? Okay, when was the last time you see one of those rockets destroy an entire building? No, no, no. Sit back. If you No, no. Take your time. Take, take, no, no. One of the rockets. From 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 the so-called Islamic Jihad destroyed an entire building just being launched from the sky. Uh huh. Ladies and gentlemen, does this look like a one rocket? But they said it misfire. I didn't know. Hold on now, misfire. That that's a misfire. One, two, three, four. Ooh, wee, that's a pretty good misfire. Now, let's go past the Ukraine junk. Let me show you all this. The Palestinian, the Abbas, you know, that, that presidential Abbas, he cancels the meeting with Biden because <laughs> what do you think? Okay, then Britain is going to work with allies of the United States government. That's the ally they're talking about to find out what happened at the Gaza hospital. Excuse me? Find out what happened. Wait, didn't we find out what happened right here? We don't want no misinformation here. Didn't we find out already the IDF? When the IDF tell y'all what something happened, y'all got to follow the IDF. IDF said it happened, it happened, all right? Because that's what Google told me. Google told me that whatever the IDF says is fact. Literally, they took a video down, the one where I talked about the October surprise and the false flag. They took it down because I was talking about this very same stuff and using the report to talk about it. Google said, no, that's misinformation. So what's true, Google? Did the IDF really document the fact that Islamic Jihad, their rockets misfired and struck the Gaza hospital? Or, hold on, hold on, hold on, keep going, keep going. Right here, Hezbollah announces a day of unprecedented anger against Israel. Why? Well, because apparently, according to the IDF, they bombed their own hospital. Calls come amid the Al-Hila hospital explosion in Gaza, which the IDF intel showed was caused by a Palestinian misfire. (laughs) Jerusalem Post again. Hold on. Let's find out. Hamas leader says U.S. holds responsibility for Gaza hospital attack. Why? The U.S. holds responsibility for the attack that killed hundreds. Why, why is he saying that if their rocket misfired? Well, they're trying to save face, really. They're trying to save face. Ladies and gentlemen, then if their rocket, pay attention, misfired, then why is Biden expressing outrage over the attack? Why, why are they expressing outrage? Well, if it was a misfire, then that means it was unintentional. But let's pay attention. Britain will work with allies to work out what happened at the Gaza Hospital. Interesting, ain't it? And then Biden calls off the little meeting that he was having with Abbas. Ladies and gentlemen, it's interesting that this rocket fire hit at the very time Biden was supposed to be meeting with Abbas. I mean, Abbas. Abbas. Isn't that interesting? 
The Rockets hit exactly right about the time they were supposed to be meeting, which means they couldn't meet, which means they're not going to meet. Huh. I guess somebody's got an agenda. I don't know who it is. It could be 21s or 30s, but somebody's got an agenda. So, ladies and gentlemen, don't go for the okie doke. Okie dokie, don't go for the okie doke. If you fall for it once, you're going to fall for it again. 9 11. If you fall for it once, you're going to fall for it again. Got to go, okay? Y'all have a good day.